Hello everyone, in this online session we are going to learn how to typeset text using LaTeX. The first thing to do is to install MakeTex 2.9 and editor text maker that I am using. There are many other editors available including Textworks and Text Studio. But for this session, I am using a text maker. Let's learn how to typeset text using LaTeX. Every LaTeX document begins with the document class as slash document class and it has got two arguments to pass in. One argument is mandatory to be passed inside a queue braces. It can be article or it can be Beamer for PowerPoint presentation or it can be journal for journal paper or it can be a conference and what we pass inside the square bracket is an optional argument optional argument can be for example A4 paper or two column and so on. For a moment, I am not taking any optional argument and let me take a mandatory argument as article. Environments are the basic building blocks of LaTeX. Environments start with slash begin command and slash ends with slash end command. One of the important environment is document environment so it starts with slash begin document and ends with slash end document body of latex document is typeset within the slash begin environment let us create our first document saying this is my first document let me run this using this button. There are various options here like quick build, LaTeX, DVI to PS, PDF LaTeX and so on. Let me choose quick build and run this. Okay, good. It's producing a first document. It's so nice. Let me include a title right here using a slash title command title that I want to give is first document and author name can also be included here using slash author command and date can be included using a slash date and I'm fetching the today's date by using slash today command so I'll run this it's not including the title and all the preambles so until I say slash make title it won't include the preambles so I said slash make title and let me run it now okay title is included In this session, we are going to make it a document with four sections. First section that we want to create is slash section introduction. So this is the command for creating section slash section with the section title in the as the mandatory argument. And second one is typesetting text third one is labeling and the last one is text. ok 
okay so i'll include the content now let me copy and paste from here so this is my content for first section when i run this it comes like this the font size and font of a section head heading is decided from the document class and it automatically introduces the numbers for each section let me copy and paste for the next section as this here we will see how to make the text as italic and bold face all that so i use slash text it to make the text in italic this text is in italic slash text bf so this text is in bold slash text rm here is a roman text and slash text sl here is a content okay so if i run this i can see the italic text bold face times roman and slanted and all colors can also be introduced changed to introduce a color we use a slash color text name sorry color name then the text this text is in in red colors can also be blue so i run this so oh, i am getting an error it's saying that undefined control sequence slash color is not recognized as a defined one so color is defined in the package that i need to include here so i am including using a command slash use package color now the error will go yeah so it has changed the colors as red blue and black next is labeling sections figures equations and tables can be referred using slash label command and slash reference command ref command for illustration i will refer to the previous sections before that let me create labels for each section using label command so command is slash label the way i create the keyword is sec and then accent title so this sec is to represent the section and intro is the section heading it is for our convenient that we can choose any keyword and for the second section i am giving a keyword as type 
third section and giving a label as a cc colon label and for third one final one and giving list Here let me refer to the section 1. So I want to say here in section 1, so that 1 I can bring by referring using slash ref command. So when I say slash ref, TextMaker will list out all the keywords, labels. So I am choosing from this a label SCC colon intro. So that will introduce a number 1 here. So it will be read as in section 1. In section 1 we have introduced latex as a type setting tool. And in section 2 Section 2 I have to bring by using the keyword SCC colon type so that I am choosing from here from the list. So in section 2 we have mentioned the way now I need to run it twice here we can see number one is introduced and here we see number two is introduced automatically so this is an advantage in LaTeX suppose I am deleting any section say I am deleting this section 2 I am deleting it or I am commenting it using control T and when I run this now it automatically changes section numbers so that is the advantage of LaTeX come to the last section so here we will create a list list can be a numbered or unnumbered one numbered List is created using slash begin enumerate command and unnumbered list is created. Using slash begin itemize command. Number list will be Using slash bit. 
begin enumerate enrollment okay now let me introduce items to introduce item i say slash item then the item name and next item to introduce the item i use control shift i then to and so on so it can be run now so it has created a numbered list that we can see here and unnumbered list is generated as follows using slash begin itemize and introduce item here apples strawberries So last one thing is missing. We can make a table of content. It's so easy in LaTeX. Unlike in Word, we have to look at each page number and the section number and the section title. So it's so tedious in Word processor. But it is very easy in LaTeX just by saying slash table of contents. So that will give me a table of content and the page number also as well the section numbers okay now I'll introduce a new page page break and I want to give the page numbering for table of contents in Roman letter so I introduce a page numbering pause the Roman as argument another body of content will go to the new page so slash new page and slash page numbering now I will say Arabic page numbering so let me run it now so we can see that first page number is Roman page number where table of content is listed with section numberings here and page numbers here and body of content goes to next page So in this lecture we have seen how to typeset text, how to change the style and font and colors of the text, how to create labels and how to refer to the sections, how to create an enumerated list and itemized list. Thanks for watching.